Hi, Shao Iris here. I'm a choreographer and dancer, and today I'm going to be reacting to Dreamcatcher Odd Eye dance video. I have been so excited to get back to Dreamcatcher. Here we go. Okay, so the choreography so far is very soft and I just feel like it's because they're going to go really hard in the chorus. It's, it's very delicate, especially for Dreamcatcher at the moment. Sorry, I didn't want it dark. This is a very, um, it's a very different style for them, actually. Um, it's, it's not soft in the way that they're dancing, but the choreography to this, it's very, it's very subtle movements. I mean, there's the odd thing that they do occasionally that's quite hard hitting, but even they're not hitting it as hard as they could. I feel like they've been told to strip back some of their skill to match the style of this choreography which is interesting because it doesn't match the this, this song maybe because I'm used to them dancing in a certain way I don't know if anything I said made sense but I, I need to watch more and I'll elaborate <laughs> I don't know if you know what I mean, but it's very um, one step, two step type choreography. So, dun, 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 dun. you know, like this, like there's a bounce, there's a move, there's a bounce, there's a move for the chorus anyway. Um, yeah, OK, this is a different style to what I've seen from Dreamcatcher. Yeah, because if you look at the dancers, it's it's that it's completely different from what you're seeing from Dreamcatcher. So I feel like they can do any style of dance though because there's not a lot that's been given to them in this choreography for, for, for them to like, you know, really dance the way that I know that they can. But their stage presence, well, they're just their presence in general is still there. It's the dancers behind them that are doing so much, but you're still, you're still watching Dreamcatcher. Um, yeah. I mean, I feel like this is the type of song that every band has this. It's like a filler performance, like filler choreography, where you, you've got your songs where you, you really go for it and all the energy has gone into to, to that song and those moves. And then you have another song that allows you to just, it allows your muscles to like calm down. You slow down with your breathing and you're getting yourself ready for another like full on song. And I feel like... This is Dreamcatcher's slow down song. I wouldn't be surprised if a member has come forward to say that they really enjoy the choreography in this song. Every band has one. It's something that choreographers, especially if you work with a band for a lot of their music, we know to do that. 
like I do that a lot with mine I, I don't want them doing song after song after song that's completely 100% of their energy I will slot something in there to help them you know gain momentum again and just calm themselves down I love these girls so much it was nice to see it it, it was slowed down the cho choreography was stripped back and I do think it's deliberate um but yeah it, it kind of, the more I watched it the more I thought that yeah this this choreography it kind of suits the start of the song you never think it with rock music but no that was nice I enjoyed that um I think I still have some from Dreamcatcher on my list but keep them coming I want to see more and hear more um Subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you on the next video. Have a nice day everyone.